So I thought I would do a bookshelf tour for you guys, um, but just keep in mind, my bookshelf doesn't have much on it. Um, I've only really recently um, acquired a love for books because I finally discovered what kind of books I like to read. Like, I used to hate reading, I'll be honest. I, My mom had so much trouble trying to get me to read when I was little, but then I realized it was just because the certain kind of books she was trying to get me to read didn't interest me. So I finally discovered what kind of books interest me, and now I love to read. So my bookshelf is still a work in progress. I'm still working on developing my library. So if you guys see any books that you think I sh need to have on my shelf or I need to read, feel free to leave me a comment below and suggest me what books you think I need on my bookshelf. So other than that, I will go show you guys my bookshelf. Okay guys, so this is my bookshelf. Um, so as you can see, I have my Harry Potter series. I have got the Philosopher's Stone, Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, The Goblet of Fire, The Order of the Phoenix, and The Half-Blood Prince. So as you can probably tell, I am missing the last one. So then I have The Hobbit from um, J.R.R. Tolkien. I have The Fellowship of the Ring, The Two Towers, and The Return of the King, the Lord of the Rings series. Then over here I have my Twilight series. I got Twilight, New Moon, Eclipse, and Breaking Dawn, all by Stephanie Meyer. Over here I have the Hunger Games by Suzanne Collins, and I tried to read the Hunger Games. <laughs> Didn't like it. I don't know, for me the whole idea of having to kill people, not really all that interesting to me. Okay, and then down here, I have my Kelly Armstrong books here. So this is her um, her YA series here. This is the Darkest Powers, which is the Summoning, the Awakening, and the Reckoning. And then she has her sister series to her YA series, which is the Gathering and the Calling. I loved the Darkest Power series. I could reread this series over and over. This one, eh, not so much. I liked it. But I didn't really love it as much as I love this one. Then over here, I have her adult series, which is The Woman of the Otherworld. So I have Bitten, Stolen, and Dime Store Magic. These are the first three of the series. I believe she has 13 released. I only have the first three. I've read these two. I still have to read Dime Store Magic. And over here, I have my... Mortal Instruments series. This is City of Bones, City of Ashes, City of Glass, City of Fallen Angels, and City of Lost Souls. Then I have the Infernal Devices, um, Clockwork Angel. I still have to buy a Clockwork Prince. And these are all by Cassandra Clare. And then over here, I have Hush Hush and Crescendo by Becca Fitzpatrick. I haven't read Crescendo yet. I am planning to. Um, Hush Hush was, eh, I didn't like it too much, but I'm hoping this one's better. Then over here by Lauren Kate, I have Fallen and Torment. I am looking forward to reading these. Then I have, okay, I really can't pronounce this author's name, so I'm just going to zoom in here for you guys. Okay? <laughs> then I have Shiver, Linger, and Forever. And over here I have my Vampire Academy series. I have the Vampire Academy, Frostbite, and Shadow Kiss. I've read these two. I am working on this one. Okay, and then down here is the last of my books. I have Daughter and Smoke of and Bone by Leanne Taylor. Then I have Heather Buer's Legacy of Trill Soulbound. And then over here I have Graceling by Kristen Kasher. So that is it for my books. So that is my bookshelf. Not much right now, so I am hoping to build on it. So you guys just have to let me know what you think I need to add. And 
we shall discuss in the comment bar. So thank you guys for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!